A new report shows Arizonans are having a harder time keeping roofs over their heads. It is because of rising rents. The lack of affordable housing is starting to impact people who may not have struggled with this in the past. Here's Carissa Planelp. House of Refuge operates this small Mesa community, providing transitional housing to 80 families at a time. One woman tells me she could not afford her new apartment without help from the nonprofit. I was hoping to just come over here, find a good apartment, and stay there. Teresa Mojica moved here from California early in the pandemic when work started to dry up. She had a job waiting for her. Finding a home for her and her five kids was the hard part. I thought it was supposed to be cheaper over here. Teresa was forced to live in her van until she got a call from House of Refuge. We do see families that come in that have never been in this situation before. Executive Director Kayla Kohler says the affordable housing crisis is so dire, the nonprofit has had to change its definition of success. House of Refuge provides low-cost rentals and support services for up to 12 months to help clients eventually move into their own homes. These days, that's not always the case. We had one family that um, could not find affordable housing, so the solution for them was um, to move in with grandma. A new report by ASU's Morrison Institute shows Arizona rental rates went up by almost 10 percent in 2019, the highest jump in the nation. For every 100 Arizonans who need a low-cost place to rent, only 26 affordable homes are available. The report suggests solutions, including policies that give developers incentives to build affordable apartments. If you're a single parent, you struggle. When Teresa's mom died from COVID last summer, she lost a crucial support system. Her adult daughter is now providing a second income. It's now enough for the family to move into a two-bedroom apartment next month. My son still has to sleep on the couch, which is fine, you know, as long as they're okay. Carissa Planalp for Arizona's Family.